Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of The Last Federation, where we are getting insanely close to brokering The Last Federation. We're just having some minor ulticalities with the fact that I'm trying to figure out how to make the uh, Skalaxians and the Peltians like each other, because that's basically the only thing that's preventing us from... Oh, wait, 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 yes, yes, yes! Okay, never mind, never mind, it seems like we actually have enough to create what I need to do. Federation deals, create the Federation safely. The Peltians must have 180 towards both the Andals and Skalaxians, and both of them must have 180 towards the Peltians. Oh, snap. So close. So very, very close. Um, don't want you guys to do that. That'd be actually terrible with you. Share, te share technology with another race. Uh, let's go Andors. Okay, execute deal. Execute deal. Alright, it seems like I need some money too. I've been doing this way too long. It, yeah, you guys as a economy actually can go... Actually, wait, you guys aren't my friends. Never mind, wait, never mind, I forgot you guys weren't my friends. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna need to improve your technology, so... I mean, assistance, medical assistance. Let's go about this for six months. Improving your medical facilities. There we go. Voila, that's all nice and dandy. That's all nice and dandy. That's all nice and dandy. All right. So let's see. You guys are the ones that's really preventing us from actually being able to make the new federation we are literally that close um in terms of everyone else liking each other they are getting really close so that's the worrying part um i don't think there's anything else i can actually do like i don't think there's any other like um minor deals i can make besides just trade but they're not willing to make trade and i don't know why um, attack the Galactic Center. I think I actually have enough relationship with these guys that actually wouldn't... It's 75, an act of terrorism. Yeah, I actually have enough relationship with these guys to where they would actually not mind it. Okay, attack the Galactic Senate, a race of technologically advanced. Says this time will take five solar months. The thirty seconds to may assassinate. Uh, yeah, that's not what I want. Plant damage relationships. I don't really care about that. Okay, but we need to figure out, can I broker any trade deals? Ah, I can't. For some reason, they're not wanting to do it. So, I guess, I guess the other way we could do this, and I didn't want to do it because I thought it was going to be a little bit lamer. But, it looks like you don't have enough credit. Current credit? What? What? What are you talking about? Okay. So, apparently, I'm just, I'm just going to have to form the Federation all natural like. Which really does kind of make me kind of feel sad in a little bit of ways, but... That's the only way we're going to be able to do it. So basically what I'm going to need to look for now is like the highest paying jobs and uh, do them for a quick second. So let's improve the Skalaxians. Alright, and we're just going to form the Federation all natural like. Let's just go right there. Skalaxians, now next go right there. Federation created with another race. Looks like you don't have enough credit. What are you talking about? I do have enough credit. Okay. Let's go try it with somebody else. Let's go try it with these guys. Uh, speak on your behalf. Convince other races to join the Federation. It looks like you don't have enough credit. 20,000. Okay, these guys want 20,000. That makes sense to me. That makes sense to me why I couldn't form the Federation. Create Federation with other races. Uh, yeah, but that doesn't make any sense to me. I have 3,000 credit? Oh, it costs about 137,000 credit. Okay. That makes sense. So the numbers right there aren't exactly what they mean. So wait, how much money do I actually do need to create this? 80,000. Oh, shoot. My goodness. This is, that is a ton of money. Okay, what about you guys? How much are you guys going to cost? Uh, 300 voting proxies. Okay, join the federation. Uh, is that really the only federation deals I could do? Or is there any others? Share technologies with another race. The Andors. Alright, but a boom. Yeah, there we go. I believe that's the only one I can do, so. Dang it. <laughs> okay, so that means the the quickest way, if it's really gonna cost me 80,000, the quickest way to do this is that I'm going to have to get. The yeah, Peltians will like each other a little bit better. But I'm also going to have to make sure that these guys don't form relationships with other people and become like, you know, BFFs with somebody else. So, mm. 
Yeah, this is going to be really complex. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Gift technology. Let's see. Space outpost. Research technology. <sighs> the problem is I don't know how to do it from here now. Like, the best... Do they actually improve relationships in a month? Let's figure out that. So let's see. 55.7. Let's just try doing something like... Something really quick like... Property attitude dealer, arms dealer. Let's say that. Let's just say arms dealer. Uh, and another maggot pox outbreak. What? Oh my goodness! There's lots of maggot uh, smallpox. Another maggot pox outbreak. I'm a computer, and it gives me the heebie-jeebies. Ah, uh, another maggot pox oh goodness, outbreak. How many maggot I'm outpost a computer, and it gives was a... me the heebie-jeebies. Yeah. Ah, uh, another maggot pox outbreak. I'm a computer and it gives me the heebie jeebies. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm amazed at how many maggot, maggot outbreaks outbreak. are. I'm a computer and it gives me the heebie jeebies. Bullocks, bullocks, uh, bullocks, 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 bullocks. Another maggot pox outbreak. I'm a computer and it gives Optimistic me attack. the heebie jeebies. Uh, another maggot pox oh my outbreak. Are you guys about done yet? I'm I'm, I, I get it. There's a maggot me outbreak. The outbreak and they all hate each other. So another maggot pox outbreak. In terms of how this is going to cool down. Uh, another maggot it looks pox like outbreak. yes, they do improve the relationship, but they don't improve the it to the point jeebies. I would like it to uh, be. Another maggot pox outbreak. So let's see, I'm what do you guys exactly trade for? Let's just figure jeebies. out uh, why do you guys trade? Outbreak. You should sure trade and it for uranium. Me the heebie-jeebies. Uh, another maggot pox outbreak. Yes. I'm a computer right. and it gives me the so, heebie-jeebies. Uh, Let's just make sure you guys are uh, as advanced uh, as me. Uh, uh, another maggot pox outbreak. Oh my outbreak. goodness, are we done yet? I'm a computer and it gives me the heat. Okay, if you guys continue another time. Uh, okay, guys, give me one second. Pox outbreak. And sorry for that, but this is going to be a new episode. I know the last episode was really, really short, especially considering that it was literally like four more minutes left. But I had to end the episode because I had to figure out a couple things. One thing I figured out is that we're going to need to get these two guys to like each other and the best way I decide to get these guys to like each other, I'm just going to I'm just going to uh, basically research tech for these guys and send them over to the uh, other people's, these guys, and then have like major tech advantage for like them. That's basically how I'm going to do it. So I'm just going to give them tech to them, make them like each other like that. Okay. That's the only way I can right now see us to actually like give text or to be able to build text. It seems like it is. So let's just quickly build the two outposts. For some reason they want to build two outposts. And then I'm going to do something drastic I usually don't do which is um... I'm basically going to claim all of my rivals uh... all of my friends uh... outpost. Because I really want to make sure that we can do this fast. Because I didn't... I didn't realize this when I was first going through the game, but like they add a new patch to where relationships actually deteriorate over time, especially if you're not already in friendly zone. And for some reason, the Scalaxians and the Peltians deteriorate at a very rapid rate. So what I'm going to do is I'm basically going to conquer a lot of give this, give a lot of these kind of things to the Peltians and make them insanely scientific. We're going to give them like almost the utmost advantage. Um. The only problem is, is that we do have to kind of, we do have to kind of betray some of our friendlier races to do it. But uh, I can't really do much about it. Really, I really can't. I mean, let's go like this. Okay, it's like there's not really much I can really do about it because like. This, yeah, there's, there's just literally not much I can really do about it. It's sad I have to attack my own friends to get what I need to do, but seriously, we are at like a crossroads. If I don't start doing it now, we basically won't be able to form the Federation. So it's just going to be way too resist energy. Okay, that's good. I can use ballistics. I love using ballistics. Ballistics are like my most powerful weapons. Let's go right here. I'm still more powerful than the Sklax series, which is good. That means I have to beat him in a firefight if I really needed to. But yeah, for some reason the relationship just keeps decreasing. And I keep... And it's not even it's not even making sense to me, like, because they have basically perfect relationships. And the Peltians aren't really a threat to Sklaxian, so I don't get why, you know, 
let's do that just so I can have a little bit more shields. I don't get why they uh, decrease at such a rapid rate. It just doesn't make any sense. I mean, just they just slowly start to hate each other. I, I don't get it, and it makes no sense to me. Yeah, this is going to be a dog fight. Literally a dog fight. All right. Yeah, you guys are anti that. Well, you guys can't fight this. I know you guys can't fight that. There we go. We pick up those guys. And yeah, and obviously I would love to form the federation a different way. Like I'd love to form it the other way, which is like, you know, just create a federation and you know go to them. But for some reason now they increase the money woes to be like 59k per each federation, which is a little bit too much. I believe that's a little bit too much for this game, especially for the economy that you can't you can't really build that big of an economy in this game, especially if you're trying to diplomatically form the federation. You just can't. So like for them to put such a high a high price tag on the uh, the creation of it really does make me kind of okay. Seems like this guy's gonna wanna. I'm gonna go a little bit faster. This guy's gonna be kind of just sitting there. Let's go right there. There we go. Get inside range. What are you weak to do? Okay, you're weak to this. Let's just keep firing. There we go. End of victory. Whoa. Okay. Uh, that was weird. Okay, let's just capture outpost. Well, that was really kind of weird. Capture the manufacturing outpost for the uh for the uh, Peltians. I actually left the science outpost, otherwise I would not have conquered it. But yeah, um, it's just really weird, and like, the new system where they like, increase the rate, rate at which, you know, the amount of money that you need to form the Federation is just ludicrous, so, I, I honestly believe it's just way too much, and, yeah, there we go, Peltines now have that, let's see, the boards, manufacturing, Peltines manufacturing, any other scientific outpost built out there, new, okay. So now what we need to do is make sure that I figure out which ones the Sklaxians do have and which ones do they don't have. Alright. Um so these guys decrease. Like watch. They're at 59.7 right now. But watch. I think it was at 60 at the beginning, so they're already starting to decrease at a rapid rate. Um if I remember correctly, they don't have any of the planetary improvement stuff, so we can instantly gain some points there. Technology, gene splicing, let's gain that. Gain that. Technology, um, non linear planetary improvement. Yeah, it's just, it's just a really, I don't know why that's a real one. And since it doesn't really give me an option of like a true relationship between those two guys, I don't know why it happened. So let's see. Let's go like that. Uh, now that's 60, now that's 62. Now they're 64, and that should facilitate some relationship. That is technology of particle that. Any other scientific outputs I can go out and go steal. So basically stealing any type of any type of uh, particle outpost or any type of scientific outpost, I'm gonna to have to come and do it. It's for the betterment of humanity, I should say. It's for the betterment of humanity. Planet cooling. Yeah, let's go right there. Planetary cooling. Oh yeah, I'm trying to remember. I think what else do they also need? Faster communications. That's also what they need. Let's see. Do we still got our uh, research facilities. Yes, we do. Right, let's get that, and then let's go back here. Go to trade deals. Share with other races. Galaxians. Faster communications. 68. 69, which say 72, at 72 now, okay, and now that we have 72, just keep going, let's see, we also need some, I'm uh, pretty sure I actually don't have fire bombs, actually, now I remember correctly, there we go, let's see, I don't quite remember though, let's see, because I did, if it really must surprise you guys, I could not, because I did not know about this whole, like, deteriorating of factions, this is a kind of reload for me, and there is, you didn't really miss much in the other, like, playthrough, I just basically, like, tried to form the Federation, and what happened was that Sklaxians kept 
we do seem to have relationships with the other people more and more until the point where they basically just hated each other and I could not like get them to like each other no matter what I tried. Okay, we're gonna try to do this. And the Sklaxians are honestly the most hardest race. Oh man, dang it. Yeah, this is going to be insanely hard to kill all these guys. Especially since they basically have the same technology I do. Oh man. Yeah. But we're gonna need to do it because we're gonna need to get that technology done. Okay. Let's see. Let's see, what is this cooking field? Jammer. Uh, disable gravity systems. Send out my probes. Start attacking everywhere. Um, next, firefight. There we go. Next, what we need to do is we need to start firing on this location. There we go. Fire on this location. Luckily, I'm still stronger than most of these guys combined. But, it's still critical that I have to literally attack these guys to get them to like me. Like, it doesn't make any sense, like, I, they should just be able, I should just be able to influence them, especially since I'm, like, their idol, to just be able to just naturally go into, uh, peace mode with the, uh, health units. I should be able to do that, but for some reason I don't, let's just destroy these guys again, so I destroy all the, uh, little ships. Let's go like right here. Okay, so we're gonna have to go like there. Okay, go like there. Ah, oh, damn it! That basically means that all I did was just anger them, uh, and I can't attack them again. So anytime if they build another research facility, I cannot do that. It really does sink. But good thing the Andor was also created one too. Uh, luckily, it does not have any defenses on it and does not have advanced tracking, so I'm just gonna be easily able to capture this. For the Peltians, guys, for the Peltians, this is all for the betterment good. So I need to make sure that with the scientific outpost, we can, we can research really insanely quick. So that we can, like, keep up the rate, the rate at which we improve relationships is going to increase. We do that, now we'll give, give this to the Peltians. There we go. Alright. So, let's see, how's the relationships now? That 72%. Which isn't too good, but they got four research facilities. They are literally chiming into outpost. Literally, we have outpost up the wazoo. And let's see, what do the Peltians not have that we do? That we can research, I should say. Besides, like that good of technology. Just go right here. Let's see, that's all they have. This is all no one has. This is all they can't do. And this is some stuff that we could probably do. Uh, orbital bobs, fragmations, uh, S3 upgrade. Let's see, we need easier stuff. We need easier stuff. Can we organize this into like category like this? Yeah, thank you. This actually makes it much easier now that I think about it. Matter compression probably could get uh, ground. Basically get anything ground related. They don't have uh, orbital stuff. Fragmation submissions. Oh, okay. We could get the fragmation submissions really quickly. Uh, uh, ground orbital shock. Fragmation submissions. I'm splicing. Oh man, we don't have the fleet box. Construction nano box. Let's go right there. There we go. Let's see. Is that, is that actually technology of this? I wasn't sure. No, it wasn't. They already have it. Dang it. Or they don't want it. That's the other way. You can also delay the orbital. Yeah, there it is. Okay, fragmission, submission. So we need that. All right, research. High explosive altitude. Oh, man. What do I need for this? I need matter compression. Oh, dang. Okay, yes. That's actually a good thing. Because then we could do a tech tree. Matter compression. Then get to the next one. Then get to the next one. Get to the next one. Uh, right now, we're just... Yeah, let's see, there we go, and then matter compression, wait, 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 before we get that, let's see, what do we need for fragmation, bomb supplementation, we need bomb supplementation, which needs low drag casting, wait, what, you are missing the following prerequisite, low drag casting, 
Oh, I, what the heck is Lord Jack Castle? Let's just get this left there. So I have better communications between everywhere. Let's see, how's the relationship doing? It's at 73, it's starting to deteriorate now. Okay, which means I only have a couple more. Let's use. I'm pretty sure they don't have fossil fuels, right? Yes, they don't have fossil fuels. Let's use that to our advantage. Improve relationships with them. I should do that actually when I have like three technologies. Okay, so fossil fuels, solar shield, and solar array. They don't have. Let's try to get that. Uh, that's pretty. That's actually pretty pricey right there. Um, actually, let's get the F tag graviton suit because I'm pretty sure they don't have that. Uh, then we need to like research technology, uh, get the anti meteor system. There we go. Alright, now we need to go down here, go to trade deals, trade with those Galaxians, matter compression, uh, fossil fuels, and wireless communication. Okay, and there we go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, we're getting so close. Literally, we're about two technologies away. Okay, okay. Okay, and that gives us a couple months to do a couple more stuff, so let's see. Okay. Alright, we can get the nanotubes. Okay, if we get the nanotubes, ground super splicing, we could probably do everything best. That, that's the last thing we need. Uh, nanotubes, you know, missing prerequisites, and nanomology. Oh, look, there's the low drag casting. That's what we needed. Okay, so low drag casting. And now what we need to find is the uh, fire array. High altitude fragmentation explosives. Bomb supplementations. Let's get that. There we go. And now that we have that, we should be able to research the uh, fragmentations. Which means this should be the last technology we need before the Galaxians officially become a part of the Union. Oh my goodness. Okay, well let's just finish up with this. Let's see if this is the last stuff we need. Hopefully the relationship didn't decrease too much. It didn't. I think we're going to be able to out, out produce. Oh, wait, 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 wait. How close are they? They must be insanely close. Uh... They're literally right there, so I want the guys watching as we try to fight against time before the decrease of the bars and everything. I will see you guys next time.